you gave the Mets Kent State lefty Joe Whitman. Uh, tell us a bit about Joe. And, you know, th- this maybe lines up with Steve Cohen's comments from the other day, which I'm not sure if you heard about how they need to add more pitching to the system. And from your what you're hearing, do you envision the Mets being aggressive picking pitching early? Well, to answer the second question first, this isn't a deep pitching draft at the top. You know, like Joe, like there's four college pitchers I think are going in the first round. Then you have maybe another four who could go in the second round. So it's not the draft to stock up on pitching for pitching's sake. Like you shouldn't, I mean, they, they may, and you see teams do it. I mean, the Angels famously drafted all pitchers a couple of years ago, but you shouldn't force it. Like if you have a hitter you think is clearly better than pitchers available with a pick, you should take the hitter. Um, I, I will preface my comment saying that like, if I get the Mets pick right at 32, then I'm doing pretty well. Um, Cause not only do you have to, you, you're guessing at that point, you also have to hope the guy you pick doesn't go off the board before then. But women's super interesting. You know, I mentioned there's, there's four college pitchers. He's the fifth in my mind. And he pitched five innings the previous two years at Purdue. He didn't pitch at all. Um, transferred to Kent State. They have, you know, Mike Burkbeck, former big leaguer, uh, is one of the probably the more underrated or I think people in the college baseball industry know how good a pitching coach he is. I don't think fans are like, so I can't state usually turns out, you know, pretty good pitchers. And he helped Whitman with his delivery, helped him with his, his secondary pitches. He's throwing harder. Now your chance for three solid pitches, he's left-handed and he just kept pitching better and better all season. I know when we were working on our mid season updates, when we didn't, we, we thought about adding him to our top 150. And we didn't. And the, and the kind of attitude around scouts time was like, we need to see more of this. We need to see him keep it going. And it just never stopped. And then it was like, oh, Joe Women's going to go in the first five rounds. And then it was Joe Women's going to go in the top three rounds. And then he pitched really good in one of his final start to regular season. I had a uh, cross checker text me. He's like, I think he's going top two. And then because Kent State doesn't have like the data set up that like some of the bigger schools do. Joe Whitman and his advisor are like, let's send him to Cape Cod League where they have all that stuff because teams it's a big thing, especially in pitchers, you want to have some data, even if it's just from a handful of starts. He went out, and I think he threw seven shutout innings. He looked great, and the data was really good. And they're like, okay, we'll stand now. Like, we don't need to do this again. Um, and he went out to the combine, interviewed with a bunch of teams. Um, so, yeah, like, like at 32, you're guessing. Like, like even the Mets, they, they don't know who's going to be there. But that was kind of my thinking was, you know what? They kind of need pitching. Like I had all those hitters I was talking about, most of them going off the board, like in past mocks, I've had them taking a couple third basemen, Brock Wilkin from Wake Forest, Johanny Morales from Miami. And I had them going ahead of them now. And I was like, Whitman's going to go in that area. Like, I think Whitman's going to go, you know, say 22 to like kind of like where the Mets would have picked originally through the end of the supplemental first round. I was like, it just that one kind of makes sense to me. I got, you know, so again, I, I mean, maybe I'll be lucky and get that one right. I don't have any great insight, but it's not like Tommy Tanowis is whispering in my ear, hey, we're taking Whitman if he's there. But um, I, I do think that pick makes a lot of sense for them. 